There's an alarming trend that parents need to know about. Many of us keep hand sanitizer around our homes and our purses, even in our cars, but it's always within a child's reach. Well, some of us even send it to our children when they go to school, right? But since the start of the pandemic, the National Poison Data System has been getting more reports of unintentional exposures in children. That includes right here in Georgia. Georgia Poison Center tells 11 Alive it is seeing a 45% increase in hand sanitizer related calls this year alone compared to pre pandemic numbers. More than 82% of cases are in children under the age of five. And the center says swallowing just a tiny amount can cause major poisoning in children. If you think about this in just plain old kindergarten English, this is equivalent to alcohol poisoning. In fact, the amount of alcohol contained in hand sanitizer is almost double that you would find in hard liquor. So smaller amounts causing more problems. My goodness. Now, according to the American Academy of Pediatrics, alcohol poisoning symptoms include sleepiness, low blood sugar, seizures and coma and can be life threatening. Call 911 right away if your child has collapsed, is having a seizure, is having a hard time breathing, or if they just can't wake up after using or swallowing hand sanitizer products. And experts urge parents to keep hand sanitizers out of children's reach. Parents and caregivers also should supervise kids five and younger when they use hand sanitizer. And of course, you can reach your local poison control center by calling the poison hotline. It's really simple. It's 1-800. 222-1222. There it is right there on the screen. Melissa, over to you.